This has not loaded yet, but your article continues below. Martin St. Louis expects to be back with Canadians next season, is my goal to be back next year. Yeah, absolutely, head coach says. I don't see many things why I wouldn't be back but you never know. John Mahoney slash Montreal Gazette. Article content Columbus, Ohio, Martin St. Louis might have created a sense of panic with Canadians fans after Monday night's 4-2 loss to the Winnipeg Jets at the Bell Center. Two story continues below this has not loaded yet, but your article continues below. Article content we apologize, but this video has failed to load. Tap here to see other videos from our team. Try refreshing your browser, or Martin St. Louis expects to be back with Canadians next season back to video when the interim head coach was asked about moving forward with the team, he said, with the guys, if I'm here next year, I don't feel I'm starting from scratch. It's only a two-letter word, but St. Louis's if was a big one when it comes to the future of the Canadians. Asked afterwards about saying if instead of when, St. Louis said with a chuckle, take whatever you want. If slash when. After Wednesday's morning skate in Columbus, St. Louis was asked if he sees any scenario in which he wouldn't be back behind the Canadians bench next season. I don't think so, he said. I was brought in here to finish the season, so I'm going to focus on that. Is my goal to be back next year? Yeah, absolutely. I don't see many things why I wouldn't be back but you never know. But if I'm visualizing myself six, seven months from now, I see myself behind the bench. Until everything is concrete and stuff I'm going to stay the course of what I'm doing. Three story continues below this has not loaded yet, but your article continues below. Article content that should ease any sense of panic with Canadians fans concerning St. Louis's future. Both Jeff Gordon, the executive vice president of hockey operations, and general manager Kent Hughes have said they want St. Louis to return with the team, and why wouldn't they? When asked Wednesday morning what the time frame might be for the interim tag to come off his job title, St. Louis said, after the season. Heading into Wednesday night's game against the Blue Jackets at the Nationwide Arena, the Canadians had 12-12- for record since St. Louis took over from Dominique Ducharme on February 9. Under Ducharme, the Canadians had an 8-30-7 record. St. Louis said he would make two lineup changes for the game against the Blue Jackets with forward Tyler Pitlick replacing Jesse Alonin, and defenseman Chris Weidman replacing Corey Schooneman. Samuel Montembold will start in goal for the Canadians. With only nine games left in the season, St. Louis said his goal for the final stretch hasn't changed. Our goal's going to stay the same, he said. It's to keep evolving as a team. Keep building our brand, our game and do some individual coaching along the way, and just try every game to be one step closer to what's next for us. And what's next for us is training camp next year, Scowan post media Twitter slash Stu Cowan one more on this topic Stu Cowan, parents laid foundation for success, Canadians St. Louis Stu Cowan, Martin St. Louis ready to show them as coach of Canadians. Share this article in your social network. Latest national stories one story continues below this has not loaded yet, but your article continues below. Montreal Gazette headline news to receive daily headline news from the Montreal Gazette. A division of Post Media Network Incorporated email address there was an error, please provide a valid email address. By clicking on the button you consent to receive the above from Post Media Network Incorporated. You may unsubscribe anytime by clicking on the unsubscribe link at the bottom of our emails. Post Media Network Incorporated 365 Bloor Street East, Toronto, Ontario, M4W3L4416383-2300 signing up. A welcome email is on its way. If you don't see it, please check your junk folder. The next issue of Montreal Gazette headline news will soon be in your inbox. We encountered an issue signing you up. Please try again.